Welcome back. As you would imagine, Rubber Duck is a huge inflatable rubber duck created by a Dutch artist, Florentine Hoffman. The design symbolizes fond memories from childhood. In addition, its size turns the harbor to a bath. Since the first rubber duck was born, it has visited 13 cities around the world. This includes London, Sydney, and Hong Kong. Mainlanders would even go out of their way to travel to Hong Kong just to see it. Well, not to worry, the rubber duck visits Beijing in September. But will people look forward to seeing it? What makes a duck, a rubber duck at that, attractive? Our researcher, Tina Pan, tried to find out. I don't know where it will be placed. If it's shown far away from here, I won't see it. There's no sea in Beijing. Rubber duck cannot be placed in the sea as in Hong Kong. I keep thinking about it. I'm surprised to hear that, but where will it be placed? Well, maybe in the Gongpei River. Since it is long, I'm looking forward to seeing it. It will come to Beijing, right? In Hong Kong, it was placed in the harbor, but there is no harbor in Beijing. Why it is popular? Um, it is huge, which easily attracts people's attention. I've never heard of it. I seldom go out apart from working, and I seldom focus on other matters, and I'm not really interested in rubber duck at all. Oh, I heard about it. It will come to Beijing, right? I think the rubber duck is cute since many people feel happy to see it. However, personally, I am a little bit worried about it. There are so many people in Beijing. It may not be proper to be shown here. It may cause some problems in transportation or other safety hazards. I am not optimistic towards it. If it arrives, I will not follow others to see it. Will it come to Beijing? Where will it be placed? Just thinking aloud. All right, well, some thoughts from the streets of Beijing on that rubber ducky. For those of you familiar with Sesame Street, you know that uh, my only recollection of rubber ducky is uh, Ernie in the bathtub, right? <laughs> Coming up, Q&A, what's got Chinese net users curious today? Stay with us.